So we've got two, two distributions today. The one is to a group of 10 uh, students who uh, So on Thursday last week, we uh, had the Team MTN Quebec, powered by Samsung, were in Cape Town for their training camp. And on that Thursday, we handed over 50 bicycles um, with the full team coming out to do those handovers with the likes of uh, Mark Cavendish, Bernie Eisel, Mark Renshaw, um, some really amazing names in, in the cycling business came out to hand over these bicycles to, to learners in Stellenbosch in Kayamundi uh, who will use these bicycles then to, to be mobile. And it was an amazing event um, and amazing for these kids to see some of their heroes um, and to be motivated around cycling uh, and change their lives. So we've got two, two distributions today. The one is to a group of 10 uh, students who've um, grown trees to win their bicycles. We just congratulate the children and for, for, for achieving and earning these bicycles because they're not just being given to you, you've earned them. Uh, and to really wish you all the best, I hope these bicycles enable you To join Brad, first and foremost, it's wonderful to, uh, to team with Dimension Data uh, in this incredible uh, environment with all of you, all these great riders, world-class riders from around the world. Uh, but the real purpose and the real reason why Deloitte uh, was very keen uh, to participate and partner was uh, to do with the Quebec charity. And the fact that uh, Deloitte is known around the world for its social responsibility and corporate philanthropy. Uh, this will be a cornerstone uh, program for us as we look to 2016. Uh, and we also want to congratulate the, the children for uh, earning their bikes. I think actually the best is yet to, to come with what they'll do on the bikes. Uh, so we look forward to that, look forward to bright futures, uh, and can't wait to uh, continue to raise wonderful money for uh, even more bikes. Yeah. Uh, so I'm going to invite Jan Schilman up, who's the representative of the school in Kaimani. And maybe the three of you can stand behind that bike and we'll do a ceremonial handover of the bike. One of 50 that will go to those kids in that school. Um, and then Jan will just say a few words after. This is a fantastic surprise. It comes at a very opportune moment. It's the year end for us. We're a school that has preschool and started our primaries achieved and that against the odds have tried the best. Thank you very much for the sponsors. I think cycling for one, apart from being a mode of transport, is a great alternative to any other form of transport. And in a healthy body, is a healthy mind. And uh, we hope that this proves to show that a reward for work done pays off. Thank you very much for being the sponsor. Programs you're running. And then what we do is into that we build in credits. So when the guy gets the bicycle, we have this contract. You say, okay, the contract stipulates that for these activities, you earn those credits. You need to earn 10,000 credits by the end of the year. If you earn those 10,000 credits, you get to keep the bike. It's yours. We sign it over. Certificate is yours. It's your bike. You're off our records, you can do whatever you like with it. So today, uh, BMT, we uh, got all the bikes from Quebec and we took them to Vision Africa School and we had a look at how we're going to implement the bikes there with the children. It's extremely exciting for us because that's the whole plan is to get children onto bikes and to obviously put the, the mode of transport uh, out there with children and allow them to have a, a method of transport as well as something to get them into sport. The good news about BMT is we've actually got a trust here where all the employees are part owners in BMT and that's also what we want to bring across to, to those children is that we can uh, create our entrepreneurial ventures with those bikes. We can start something special and, and really give them a new way of, of thinking. The good thing about the shop is all the guys from here who are employed live in Kaimandi, so they're going to be uh, intricately involved in this whole project. Uh, and our, our second head of workshop behind Mark Passenthal at Listando and Tutu, and uh, he was at the handover, and he's going to be involved actually in Kaimandi with the children. Oh, hello everyone, uh, and thanks for giving me this chance. My name is Tandu Ndutu, I'm co-owner of the business, and I have shares uh, with Christmas uh, Norton, so I'm very thankful about that. Yeah, we also would like to say thank you to MTN Kubeka for giving us this chance to allow to allow us to talk with, uh, with everyone about these uh, bikes. We have uh, too much, so much uh, thankful that we come to, and these are very blessed too. So. Uh, and it's very pleasant for us and we spread the word and I'm also the vice captain of the Isuzu 
mountain bike kayamandi so uh, we're very very grateful i must say yeah and uh, i'm also a uh, technician here at uh, bmt and we along with uh, chris norton just along um max bongani uh, ab lee and uh, mark uh, basing with our manager so we're very very thankful about that that's all i have to say mm -hmm.